What's up boys and girls, I'm Nikhil. I thought I'll get only 200 to 300 views for my previous video, but I got unimaginable number of views. And I believe very strongly that majority of you would have clicked it by mistake. But thank you for making that mistake. The purpose of this video is to tell you what exactly happens on the day of your JE mains examinations. On the day of your exam, try not to use your phones and go to the exam center with your parents and not your friends. The reason is same because you have no control of what information you'll receive. The details of your exam center, the date and the shift will be given in a hall ticket. Usually in a single day, two shifts are there, morning shift and evening shift. Morning shift will be usually from 9.30 to 12.30 and the evening shift will be from 2.30 to 5.30. To your exam, you need to carry your hall ticket along with it, one passport size photo and uh, an identity proof which can either be your Aadhaar card, your passport, your driver's license or your PAN card and pen, mask and your sanitizers. So all of you will have staggered entry timings. That is, let's consider your 9.30 exam. Some people will have to report at 7 a.m., some 7.15, some 7.30. This is to avoid crowding outside your exam hall. And uh, thing is that if your exam is at 9.30, you will be allowed to enter your exam hall only till 9 a.m. After 9 a.m., the exam hall will be closed. You cannot enter your exams. Even if you are late, try your maximum to reach half an hour before the starting of the exam. Inside the exam hall, social distancing will be maintained very well. In your hall ticket, you will have a place for a thumb impression. Earlier, in the pre-COVID times, you would have a biometric scanning at the exam center. But here, you should put the thumb impression. And the authorities will ask you to remove your mask that you have been wearing from home and they'll give you a new mask. While writing your exam, you should only wear that mask. This happens in JE means In JE Advanced, they don't do this. You can wear, wear your own mask. After all the initial checkings, they'll tell you your floor number and the zone. Basically, every floor is divided into several zones. So you should go to that particular zone and they'll take your photo and your seat number will be given. In your seat, there will be already five uh, A4 sheets placed for rough work. If you want more sheets, you just have to raise your hand. They won't limit, they'll give N number of sheets. And while leaving your exam hall, you have to leave your hall ticket, your rough sheets there itself. They'll collect those. You are not supposed to carry those home. 